What is up everybody, this is your host Supersai and welcome back to another video in which we'll be building a computer worth 1,400 US dollars. Now note, this is only including the CPU, GPU, SSD, HDD, and RAM. Does not include the motherboard, does not include the case, or the monitor, or the power supply. So just making that case, monitor, power supply. That's the one. Yes. Okay. So, let's go. Let's get it. Now, I wasn't actually going to do it today. I wasn't. So, I've been doing a series of this. Uh, not that one. What I was, but because of this comment here, because I, I was, I was just gonna go play Minecraft to be honest today, and I wasn't gonna do this video. But I'm like, and I will do it another later day. But I'm like, no, 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 no. But, but interesting, because this guy here. So shout out to there we go, Frick True Wave. There we go. Thanks for these videos. I've been trying to build. Uh, I have been trying to build. These have been really helpful and made and made me be able to make up my mind on the paths. So two things. That's awesome. But also that's like, oh my goodness. Oh yeah. And take everything I say with a grain of salt. It's like. It's like, I, I better get these good, because, like, if you were actually, like, looking at these, which, uh, yeah, yeah, I don't know, I guess, I, I kind of hoped that some people would, like, find them interesting, and maybe, like, help them make up their minds, but it, it certainly, like, puts the pressure on it's like, I'm responsible, I actually have to choose the best, best, best parts, like, I can't just randomly chuck that in and that, like, this is actually people gonna, like, look at this and that, so I have to be, like, just try my absolute best to get it right at that, because I just do it for fun, you know, and that. But at the same time, I choose the parts that I genu gen genuinely would choose if I was building a computer, or for the average given Joe blogs and that. So anyway, I just sort of do that. Also, so yeah, shout out, thank you for that, for that which, you know, like, okay, we can do another one. Slightly unrelated note, uh, as of not last night, but the night before last night, I finished watching all, every single one of the Pixar films. So I finished, the, I started with Inside Out back at the start of May and that, when I had my collapsed lung and that, I, the next day I watched it and that. And then slowly I went through and watched each and every one of them and finished the night before last with Wally and that. So they're all really good movies in that. Some of them I prefer way more than others. Cars 3 and Inside Out were was two or two of my standouts in that. I no, I don't know if that's a fist. Like, I mean they were, but as in there'll be other ones that I loved it as well. But yeah, I, I yeah, I like the cars. The cars series was probably my favourite of the series, more so than Toy Story and Monsters Inc. But I love the Monsters Inc. as well. That's a good one. But they're all good movies in that. There we go. Again, some definitely more than others in that, you know? Like, yeah. A couple of them I didn't enjoy so much, but... Yeah, most of them were absolutely fantastic. So that there is indeed... I love, I love it, because, like, you know, it's got all these different people listed here, and then just, like, The Incredibles? Brad Bird just stretches across director, screenwriter, story by, like, legend. And with this one, yeah, I mean, that's, that's, yeah. Anyway, but yeah, incredible work. Okay, there we go, boom. Moving on to the actual, what we're talking about today. So, there we go, we're going to have the build, and I'm going to show you a couple of things. I'm going to show you why I've been picking the CPU and the SSD that I keep picking and that, just so it may make it clear, because I don't, because often now it's to the point where I just say, okay, we're just going to chuck in a 3,000, like this right here. I want to show you why I'm picking that. Okay, there we go. Right. Rather, because I have showed you on one of the videos, but then all the other ones I don't, although then people watching the last one or watching the one after this, they don't watch this one. Yeah. Okay, so anyway, how am I doing that? Is I would go to this here and I do this thing here. I think this is like if you if you're putting your computer, this is my understanding of it, which may be wrong. If you're putting your computer into like full like do everything like go 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 without overclocking it and that. The ones with the high sixty four core points, there we go, are the ones that do really well, like, they can handle lots and that, because, like, yeah, so it's sort of like, there's one core, two core, four cores, eight cores, but if they have more than eight cores, well, they're sort of doing all 64, although one day, maybe there'll be one with 128, I don't know, anyway, maybe there already is with supercomputers, I don't know, but although they combine heaps of different ones, but anyway, so I did sort of like this here now, because often I sort, sort by the average benchmark in that, which I've been doing in recent times for the GPU exclusive model in that, you know, as an overall one in that but so I go like this right here and the one I've been picking is this one right here so as you can see mass it stands out see what stands out to me the price like you look around it just below 1500 just above it 1600 then 800 and that you know and 900 and that and then here's one there's hundreds of dollars less that does super well on this scale right here there we go even so if we go show all prices there we go boom and if we well if we for example say okay let's say we don't want to spend you know over 600 dollars oh wrong one over six hundred dollars on this so we drop it down to like here there we go boom there you have it second in the line you know and see this one here 
it's only a little bit more for that one. It's worse for the average benchmark, and it's an extra two hundred dollars in that. So if so, yeah, as you can see, this one ranks super duper high for that category, and that's partly why I like it. Now, if we reset it and we go to average benchmarks, you're like this, and then we go show all prices like so. Bam, and then we come down. Oh wait, man, yeah, the Intel wants to do so well on that. It's 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 first. It's first right here of it's yeah, I didn't even realize that it's the first non-Intel one I didn't even know that you know, but and so yeah because the average benchmark of the Ryzen ones aren't that good in that But they are for the three the the 64 core thing. They're really really good And ideally you want it high on both the average benchmark and the 64 core and that and this one compared to the ones around it like that's way way although that is way cheaper as well but that's like is it like three times cheaper three times like that but only twice as cheap in that and those are about the same you know and like it's see that one there's comparable but again that's like double the price in that that one's better but no price i'm not buying items that don't have a price in that but of these ones here i think it's the top one out of all, all 2136 and that's 2000 oh that one's slightly higher than that but as you can see it it, it really for the for this thing here it incredibly sticks out in that you know and so for example well if let's say we, we did it on average benchmark but said that they have to have at least like 1500 for the 64 thing there we go so we'll come up here and we'll go like there we go 1500 like that there we go and boom oh there's actually quite a few that are over there okay Let's say, oh, the heaps of them are, oh, like, right there. So, let's say 1,600 and that, and then it'll wipe out all those ones. Uh, one, oh, fine, that will do. There we go, bam. And then all of a sudden, oh, there's still more. But anyway, as you can see, so these here are the options here. Now, these ones haven't got a price. And again, I'm not buying ones that don't have a price. So, these ones could be better, but if they don't have a price, I'm not... Although, these are, yeah, these are all really, really, really new ones in that, that have just come out. So, the, yeah, they, you can not a I don't think you can buy those ones or the oh, but this one here let's say so this is the comparable one in that but again it's worse for that and it's about the same for that and it's double the price I'm like this one and then this one here is the one when I get to the sort of like the 2000 US dollar budget I probably will jump to this one it's not as good value as you can see and that because you know it's an extra like 300 no wait oh uh, yes 300 dollars you know for uh, and not a 300 dollar like percentage price percentage increase to that increase in that but it is still a really good option although with that one you then need a fan because it doesn't have an integrated one in that but this one here is really popular in that yeah these have almost nothing in that yeah this yeah well if we go to let's say we reset it right boom and we go to average benchmark there we go and we say it has to have at least a thousand samples i like i just don't like ones that haven't got much samples because a there's not as much data although like three 999 samples would still be pretty good but as in there we go where is the samples filter there we go oh maybe we have to add it over here so if we go samples like this there we go boom and there we go so if you say like let's say we want at least a thousand right so that actually gets rid of so many of them boom like that there you go, those ones have a, there we go, let's add, so that one's now 18, let's say we whipped it up to, there we go, to 10,000 samples, okay, there we go, boom, there we go, oh, there's still quite a few of them that are more popular than that, but see, oh no, those ones are both 10k, exactly in that, you know, but yeah, yeah, so that one's sort of, yeah, a popular good option, so that's why I like that one, for the SSD, there we go, I'll just compare that, uh, so if we go to value in that, boom, there we go, and let's say, and the, and the let's say we want to spend under 100 US dollars on the SSD in that, because there's always been about three of them that are all good options in that, and I always pick one of them, and I'm going to show you why, we go show prices, bam, so these top three here in that, so they've all got slightly higher than these things here and that and these three are the interesting this one's more pop like, like people like it more than that but i've always been picking this one here so these three are all very similar but if we click on like this one versus this one one dollar in it and that boom like so i've always been choosing this one here and that so as you can see effective speed is, is nothing different you know they're both ranked 30 in that but if we go down to average score there we go an average score yeah it's not, it's not, there's no clear winner, is there? Because this here has overall better for those things there, whereas that's better for that. Yeah, so, and then that's, yeah, better for those and better for that, you know, but if, if you did it based on, and like, well, if you did it based on the percentage-wise, this is 12% better, but I mean, these are slightly better for these things, whereas those are better for those things right there and that, so, yeah, I mean, they're, they're, they're pretty similar, actually, they're pretty similar in that, but yeah.
Yeah, so they're very, very, very similar. But I've always been picking this one here. But, I mean, as you can see, both of them are just about as valid as each other in that. You know, and then if we go to this one versus this one here, which is the quite popular one. There we go. This one here, 3%, uh, 7% for the peak score in that. And set at 3%. So, it's, it'd be they're virtually identical. That's my point. I, I, I picked this one, though. I picked this one, but for the one for the earlier models, but any th of those three are all all good valid options. Okay, so that's that. Now, if for example we say that we have a two hundred dollar budget, give or take, there we go, like that, bam, there we go. I've been going with this one right here in that because I just think because if you go to the average like this, boom, it ranks first in that. For a couple of other things, it ranks first as well. Like for for this one here, it ranks first in that. So this one here is the one that I've also been going with for a few of them because I really, I think it's just really good quality in that. Oh, this one here, 1%. It's got like this tiny lead, like this minuscule, but like 1% consistently in all of them except for that. Yeah, again, these two are virtually identical as well. There we go. But yeah, I've been going with that one. So the almost, those two are basically the same. I bought that one for myself. Okay, there we go. So let's go and let's go ahead and create this. We'll come back to that. Now this one will go with this one right here. So I'm going to start creating it now. There we go, like this, like this, like this. There we go. And it's the two. See, this one here is virtually like double, you know, for the for the space. But the speed is about the same. Boom. Okay, there was that. And then we'll go motherboard wise. I'm going it for. I'm not. Sure. I'll just show you which one I've got. So it was a. It was an ASUS, this one here. This is the motherboard I've gone for, for the one that I've bought and that, you know. So just out of interest. Okay, there we go, boom. Then for the RAM, the RAM, we know which one we're going to get, RAM. Oh, wait, I'll get rid of me. I'll get rid of me. There we go. Okay, and goodbye. Okay, here we go. So we go in for the RAM. Now, the RAM is the same that we've been going for both of them. You know, it's a solid, a solid. It's the 3200 C16, and it has 2 times 16 which is an absolute solid amount of RAM for both designs. Okay, like that. Boom. And like that over here. Boom. For the SSD, the, oh, wait, no, we've already done the SSD. So we have the HDD to go. Okay, HDD. Oh, it will depend on which one we end up going for. There we go. Because we could go... So, cause how much have we got now? There, oh, no, we still need to get the graph... Ah, uh, uh, okay. I'm, not, I'm just trying to figure out which one we'll go for. Okay, there we go. So, for this one here... There we go. See, that one there is solid, but it is... There we go. So, let's say we go for this one right here. It's sort of just an all-round... All-round a really good one in that. And then we'll see how much we can spend on the graphics card in that. Like this right here. There we go, and Kachow, boom, and so there we have $59, and it's, how much are we making it? 400 so 57 no, 59 so $459, that's heaps, okay, there we go, GPU, okay, here we go, so what do we do for the filter? We have the average benchmark as 80, like that, oh, like that, oh, that'll do, go bam, and then we say a price, and then we show all prices, and we say a price of over, under, there we go, it's about 700 US dollars, there we go, like that, boom, and we're left with these GPUs, there we go, this one here, there we go, is not, so, uh, in fact, but these are, these are the ones, this, I, this, in 2020, I would get one of these, one of these hands down. Nothing more, nothing less, because it goes all the way from $290 all the way to $700, and it's sort of about the cheapest, really good version of a graphics card, and in and, and my opinion. Again, some people are willing to spend way more on a graphics card than that, but for me, this, this year is where the cookie crumbles. So, we get we have about 400 so about, uh, how much, there we go, 59 $59, 459 so let's say we drop that, just because we, you know, sort of, Let's say down to about here. Bam. So we have nine left. Boom. And 459. So can't really choose that one, to be honest. There we go. Oh, 500. Unless we went with a... We could... There we go. We could go with a worse HDD. There we go. And go with that one right there. Boom. There we go. $500. There we go. We could do that. Oh, wait. No, $41. Mm, not really. Oh, we could go with a slightly... Uh, no, no, actually, we'll, we'll not this one. In a future build, we'll, we'll do that. Okay, there we go. Because I, I originally was going to order... Well, I originally ordered that one, but then it hadn't shipped. And so I cancelled and I ordered this one instead. Okay, there we go. So, 
there we go. These are the different options in that that you can get that are all all good good options in that. So let's say we go with this one here. There we go. Well, why is that one more expensive? That would be much worse value, won't it? Okay, there we go. So that one is. There we go. It's oh eight percent. Oh yeah, it's yeah when they're like it's weird when they're like for this is better and for that is better. There we go. But for the other things it's better. There we go. But it is it is quite a bit more. And this one is a newer a newer model in that. That's a Nvidia one. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. So effective speed. This one's faster in that. Oh there there we go. They're both getting popular now. Boom. This one is better for, yeah, I'll go with this one. Okay, there we go. With this one right here. There we go. Boom. Although, but for gaming, for gaming, I think you'd go with NVIDIA, the ones that are recent, because they have ray tracing in that. Although, if you only if you play a game that has ray tracing in that. But for this case, we'll go with this one right here. Because it is cheaper, and it is about the same speed, like some things, the other one's faster than that. Okay, there we go. So, we'll go to GPU. There we go. Boom, boom. And like that one, because personally, when I was deciding, I was choose, I was going with the Nvidia one and that, but the 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 the, the oh, AMD ones I think are better value overall and that, because if we go to the value, there we go, boom, yeah, AMD, AMD, that one's that one's oh yeah, that's a really old one and that, but yeah, there you go. Well, that's not good value, that's old one as well. Yeah, it's crazy. That one is old and that's a good value one. That's old and that's a bad value one and that. But that one's, yeah, good value one from 2017, I think. You know, but these two are really good value ones and that. Boom. So that... What? This is... Wait. Wait. How much How much do we have again? It's 1,000... Wait. Is it 1,300 or 1,400? Oh, super sight. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There we go. It's 1,400. Okay. There we go. Wait. Okay. So we have an extra 100 bucks. Well, in that case, we're going. Well, I know what we're going with. Okay, there we go. That's no. There we go. I know what we're going with. We're going with the super. We're going with the super. Okay, there we go. So, like this versus this. I'll just show you those two. There we go. Oh, okay, there we go. So that. Oh no, but that is with a bad HDD. That's true. There we go. Oh wait, where is the? Like that right there. There we go. Boom. Let's go. And oh, that's on special, which might not always be. There we go. And then we still have an extra. $59 to spend. Oh, oh, so we had, yeah. Okay, there you go. Yeah, this one here, I would say, is undoubtedly better. There we go. Well, for gaming and for, yeah, basically everything. Not for gravity. There we go. Oh, not for these things either. Hmm. There we go. Definitely not for those things. In there. I don't know how important these things are. There we go. I'm, I'm not an expert on this. Okay, there we go. So that's that. Boom. So, and I will just have a look at the HDDC if, the, if we can do better than what we're at. So, wait, $59, and we're currently at 86, or that's sometimes 88. Uh, so about, 50, oh no, about 60 more dollars. So about 140. There we go. I think that's a, it's a stupid range, because it's like, not quite. It's it's annoyed. They're just a little bit too expensive. There we go, like that. Boom. Okay, there we go. So, see, that's a 5 terabyte one. But, I don't know. Yeah, it's just sort of, just a little bit out of range. There we go. So, capacity... Bam. Oh, there's two 5 terabyte ones. There we go. Barracuda desktop. Okay, it was versus... There you go. It's, it's slower, but it is an extra. There you go. That versus that one there. Okay, these two here. Just have a gander. Is it worth spending that extra dollars? That's 30% faster, but I mean, if you had an SSD, I mean, that costs like an extra 60 bucks. Nah, probably wouldn't, eh? Okay, there we go. So, yeah, that there is indeed the... There we go. So, this here is actually... Um, it's getting near identical to the one that I ordered. This one right here. This one here would be an absolutely insane design if you ordered this one. So, I got this one. The only difference that my one had was that for the HDD, I just got the maximum one because I intend to record and store a whole heap of stuff on it. So, this right here was the actual the exact one. Oh, well, no, actually, I got the I got the RAM in, in the form of the rib jaws, and so, but it's about the same. So this here was virtually the exact same one that I actually got myself. I literally ordered it. So, and and, and if it wasn't for the rib jaw ones, I'd buy, be buying this RAM here and that. So, uh, so, yeah, I can 100% assure you I'm not just making this stuff up as to what I buy. I literally, I've bought this. So, like, my 
like, money's on the line as well. Like, as in, I paid for that, so I'm not making this up. Like, as in, that said, I'm, I'm still not, nevertheless, not an expert in that, but I actually did buy that, for the record. So, uh, this right here, like, I bought that part, that part, that part, that part, and, like, not, not that exact part, but effectively that part. It was just slightly different. Okay, there we go. Boom. It was just in the form of double that, so it cost twice as much, but I'm going to use, like, probably maybe three of them for the thing. Anyway, okay, so that's that. Now we're going to go to the non g So that, and how much is that? And that's with, that's with, like, like still cheaper in that. There we go. That's okay. It's hard to, to hit the exact increments in that, because the parts are starting to get, like, further and further apart, as in they get more expensive in that. Okay, CPU, and we go, Tony's Tire Service. Yeah, that's a radio ad in, in New Zealand in that. There we go. Uh, so, we're going to go with, there we go, that one for, that's higher average benchmark in that. There we go. Wait, oh, what I should really do... There we go. We should do an 8-core. Oh, wait. Is there an 8-core? Oh, there already is an 8-core in that. So, because I've always been going with this one right here. Yeah, I think that's probably fair. So, if we say... Well, yeah, if we... No, oh, yeah, because if I put over 90% benchmark and over 1,000, they'll be the only two that meet the criteria in that. Well, let's just put over for the 8. There we go. There we go. To over 1,000. I think I'll still conclude the same thing, but just to check. Wait, why does it only go up to 10,000? There we go. Oh, is it, is it the highest one? I don't know what the price on this goes to. What? Really? Okay, there we go. So there's only, they're the only ones that even had it in that. That's crazy. There we go. Oh, and that's that one. That's that one. This is the, what a legend of a one. It hits the eight core. That's, oh, no, no, no. That's over the samples. There we go. That will be why. Okay, there we go. Boom. And, and they all do have their prices showing in that. Yeah, they do have their prices showing in that. There we go. So, okay, it's still got that filter. Yeah, but if we, if we push it up to, we push it up to a, can we hit a thousand? There we go, boom. You got only twenty have a thousand for the and these ones here are all insanely expensive. Although no, we actually technically can afford insanely expensive, but we do we well we're not spending over a thousand. Bam. Okay, there we go. That's what we're left with. And we've been going with this one here. Yeah, because these two are the same, except for that one's different. So it's like yeah. Okay, there we go. And so because for the thousand and that because this one here needs a graphics card. So for for the for the GPU exclusive one, which I wouldn't recommend you buy. I don't know. It, maybe it's just misleading for me to even make it because I wouldn't buy it because it's just it, at the uh, earlier levels it made sense because the GPU was so expensive you could like you just didn't want a GPU model. But when you're going to be spending like five hundred dollars on a CPU and like hundreds on these other parts, you might as well buy a GPU. Like that, there was like a $290 GPU, you might as well get that. So, I don't know, I sort of still make these, but I don't know if that's even fair to make these, because it's, it's just almost misleading, because I wouldn't recommend you buy it. There we go. It's, yeah, I don't know. It, at the early levels, it definitely made sense, because the GPU was so expensive that actually any dollar you could move in towards getting a better CPU made sense. But now that we've got the maximum CPU, we just ended up putting hundreds and hundreds of dollars into SSD and HDD, which is not really necessary if you're not going to buy a GPU. Like, if you're going to spend that much on a computer, like $1,300, you may as well buy a GPU. Like, yeah. Okay, there we go. So these here are our, are our options. Now, the ones that... Well, that one's very, very recent. Oh, that's... Man, that was just six months ago that came out. There we go. So... There we go. So that's faster for that as well. There we go. We're, well, let's add in the 64 thing right here. There we go. Bam. So that's like that. Because we've been going with... Yeah, so that one's slightly slower in that. But these ones here are better. But yeah, so... And we'll go with Intel. Pardon me. There we go. And we'll say we want to have it... I was going to say at least a thousand of that. But like, if, if I, uh, that would knock out that one. So, are these ones... Well, they're worse for that. The better for... Oh, no, but these are hundreds of dollars, though. That's true. I mean, we could technically jump to them. Technically. Uh, so, and that, we're not going for that one, because that's that one. There we go. This one... Wait, let's just check out this one versus this one. That's an i7, but so maybe there's less cores. No, same amount of cores when you look at that. But threads, this one does have more threads. There we go. That one's so much cheaper as well. See, yeah, I don't know. I'm not... Oh, uh, yeah, because, yeah. Why would you go with this one over that one? It's, like, 150 cheaper and, like, the same. <laughs> Literally. Oh, no, no, for the 64. Okay, for the 64. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Fair enough for the 64. But, but it's got the same amount of cores, so... Hmm. There we go. 
Hmm. Oh, wait, no, no, this one here is that. Yeah, so if we say that it had to be at least a thousand for the 64 core. Uh, yeah, like slightly over that just to knock out those two. Bam. There we go. So, and then we're left with this. And that one is a not no goer because of that. There we go. And these two have less than a thousand samples in that. Doesn't mean they're bad. And they do cost a, a lot extra in that. So, yeah, would we, and what, there we go. So let's say we look at, like, this one versus this one. Let's just compare the two. Okay, there we go. So this one is faster for those things. What? Faster for everything. Oh, wait, no, 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 not for these. Okay, so they're better for the multi-core and that. For the average given show blogs, this is going to be better, and they save $300. So we're sticking with this. Okay, there we go. Yeah, because, I mean, some, yeah, I mean, yeah, I, I think that overall this one here would be better much better value on all okay there we go so we'll go with this this cpu bam there we go like that and now we need to we have how much we have literally like seven hundred dollars to spend on an ssd there we go like that boom there we go we'll copy that over because that's an awesome one and for the hdd we'll go with this one right here there we go bam and we still have another $200. Well, in that case, I'm going to go with I, what I consider the best possible SSD, in my opinion. And I, if I had more if I had more money, I would have bought this one. Well, I mean, I could have bought it, but I just, I, I couldn't, I just don't think it's worth it. Because, I mean, I want, I, why I wanted it to have an average life faster benchmark than that is because if live streams crash, you want to get them up ASAP. But the one th the one th one terabyte one versus the two terabyte one, I just couldn't see a justification. So this here is the one that I bought, this one right here, and this is the one that I consider to be the best SSD ever. But I couldn't see the justification because if we if we go speed wise, the more or less very very similar. There we go, like this here. There we go. So. The, except like that one there slightly faster than that but for everything else it was virtually neutral in that so the only thing you're paying for is the extra terabyte worth of sp uh, with, with ssd which i'm not going to use because i i'm not gonna i'm gonna i'm not gonna save anything to that ssd itself and so i mean maybe they'll do like a real short 4k or 16k test in that but i don't need two terabyte worth of space to do that so i i just thought nah i'd rather save two because there's us dollars for and which is a lot for me 200 US dollars, and so I went with this one here. I would have preferred this one, but I just, for $400, I just, no, I just couldn't. Okay, there we go. So, and so that's that's my favorite one right here, my absolute favorite one, which I'm going to choose in that. If we go to average benchmark, there we go. I still don't get why these are, there we go, like, faster for that. Okay, there we go. Now, we're going to get out the, wait, out, if we go to advanced mode, so expert view, bam. There we go. Let's go, and then we go to, not that I'm an expert, it's just, there we go. <laughs> Fancy. I uh, see this one here. It is top, with the exception of those three right there. You know, and then if we go to let's say read, bam. There we go. It's not the top. It where is it? Oh wait, no. I should. Oh no, I can't pin it because then it. Oh no. So it's not fast for you. But if we go to the 4K things, it does. It performs better. There we go. So, oh, still nowhere to be seen on that list. I think it's 4K right it as well. There we go, boom. Yeah, there we go. So excluding these things here, these PCI things. There we go. Wait, is there form factor? There we go. Oh, it's, uh, yeah, well, it, but yeah. So there's the SATA and all that. There we go. So it, it's this one here. Although that's the 500 one. That's the one terabyte one. And that's the two terabyte one. So they're all, there we go. For this one here, there we go, bam. And the, yeah, not, okay, this is not very helpful, is it? It's, it's not, it's not even, it's not even proven by point. <laughs> For the right, it is though, as in, because I, if you were writing, if you are writing in 4K, it would be good for that. Yeah, so it's good for something and that. And for the average benchmark, which is very important, it does indeed feature, there we go, up there and that. As it, see, the one terabyte one is close behind, so they're very, very similar and very, very high and that. So this one here is what I personally would, only 800 people have it, so it is less than the 1,000 samples, that is true. There you go, but I can, in my opinion, 
I would like this if I had an SSD. I was thinking and considering spending the extra 200 US dollars, but I just can't justify it. The speed is not faster, and the reason why I wanted a really fast one is because if I need to reboot it ultra fast, you know, because there's an issue in that to get the live streams back up, which because it's going to be a live stream computer, I need it faster than that. But all that the 2 terabyte one did was just double the, it didn't double the speed, it doubled the space, but I'm not going to use that extra terabyte, and it's been 200 US dollars, I'd rather put it towards getting another computer that I can stream on rather than trying to boost that one even more so there we go if we go to the ssd boom this one here an absolute unit there we go so there we go it is slightly over on that but that there is indeed the two options in that so hdd i like this one here this is the one i've ordered that ssd this is the one i ordered this is the one that would be cooler but it's it's not why has it got value as higher there we go i don't it's because they're effectively the same speed in that so this one here i went with even though that one is you get an extra terabyte, but I'm not going to use that extra terabyte, so... But yeah, both of these, again, would be very valid options. I personally would get this one here. There we go. But this one here, I mean, you have, like, the fastest SSD possible, just about. As well as, like, the HDD that has 12 terabytes of space. You know, both of them have an absolute solid RAM. And the, the CPU, I definitely prefer this one with the CPU like that. I prefer that CPU over that CPU. Plus, you get a graphics card with the, this model and that. But both models there, I would consider to be very, very good models. And look at this, like, UFO, UFO, UFO. I even won't even know to go, where to go from here. Because this, this year was literally about the model I got. Except I had that HDD and RAM slightly different. You know. But, but but I didn't I didn't I, I went to that point because I felt that value you could still get solid as value although the graphics card I could have gone for a slightly cheaper one in that but you could sort of get maximum maximum value out of that and like it, it was just it was just so I haven't really figured out past this point because up until this point I was actually doing heaps and heaps and heaps of calculations like that versus that that versus that that versus that that versus that before like I started the stream in that I, I mean like before I started doing the series in that you know but now that I've actually gone ahead and and sort of like got this because I just thought it post this point it sort of starts to get like so, like, as it will soon, we'll eventually we'll get this here, which will be the maximum pot. So, effectively, that's the maximum SSD that makes sense, because that's the fastest one you can get. And then this one here just gives an extra terabyte. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't go past that SSD point, except I guess to this point, you know. And HDD, I wouldn't go past this. Well, I mean, that's like the best one you can get. RAM, you could get double that, but. Yeah, <laughs> and then I guess we could finally we'd start upgrading the the CPU or GPU with that. But I mean, this here is about as maximum value you can get for a computer in that. You know, well, I'd say with that with that HDD. But post the, that's why I got it because I considered it like it's perfect for my streaming needs. It's incredibly good value in that. And post that point, you start to lose value in that because parts like it might be like let's say ten percent better for like. 30% more expensive or whatnot, so I'm like, no. Nah. So this is what I got. I settled for this as an absolute solid unit of a computer, way better than this one, my current one I'm recording on. It's great for streaming, it's great for the average day use. It should last years and years and years, that's the hope, but we'll see. But if you're not going to GPU, which I recommend, if you're going to spend over 1,300 US dollars on a computer, I'd recommend you get a GPU. You don't need to get that one, you can get the one that's $290, which is still a good option in that. But yeah, I would recommend you go with this one here. There we go. It's 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 so good in that. But yeah, th this one here would also be a very, very good computer as well. But that's going to wrap up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And this has been your host, Superside. And I'm going to say goodbye now. And I'll see you all soon for another video of that. So have a wonderful, beautiful rest of your day. And yeah, see you later.